Hungarians are the only nation on the planet who are unhappy to run into each other in foreign countries. <laughs> Two Australian people who don't know each other just recognize each other's accents across the room from wherever they are. And what do they do? They go, oh, Australia, oh, Australia, and then they get drunk. <laughs> or if it's Spanish people, same story, it's like, hey, Spain, hey, Spain. Uh, they want to say Spain, but they can't say the sp, so they go, Spain, like it was ass pain. <laughs> it might be a pain in the ass to meet other Spanish people. I don't know, it might just be the top, of, I don't get it, I don't, I don't want to get into detail. But when it's Hungarians, they might be like, hey, Hungarians, fuck. <laughs> We have more Polish people here. I, I like Poland, man. I toured there. I just don't know why do you guys freestyle on the letters? <laughs> I've been to a place called Lodz. Lodz! <laughs> See? It's L-O-D-Z. And you're like, no, no, it's Wuch. It's like, no, no, it's Lodz. It's like, in, it's Lodz. It's like, it's, we pronounce it Wuch. No, so I, I had a fantastic time in Vooch. Actually, actually let, 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 let's meet in the middle, Lodz. As long as I can freak Austrians out by saying Guten Morgen at 2 o'clock in the afternoon, it works. That's all I have to do. They're walking down the street and they're like, Morgen. <laughs> Idiots. I lived in the bad district of Vienna for four years. You know what the worst thing that happened to me? A guy asked for a cigarette without saying bitte. It was a really traumatizing experience, too. He just, uh, walked up and was like, Chick. And I said, Nine. And he said, Entschuldigung für die Romanians, make some noise. Just let me enjoy it for a second. As he mentioned, I'm Hungarian. This is probably the only time.